All right, guys. So you wondering, how did I get the money to buy a Vendo 21 a vending machine? One, I'm not for sure, but, you know, if I'm going to buy a used machine or a new one. But I do know that I got the funds to do it. All you got to do is watch the video to see how I did it. And the only thing that you got to do is watch the whole video. You know what I mean? And also, if you're new to my channel, please subscribe. Give me that thumbs up because we're trying to grow like a plant. You know what I mean? And I need your help to grow like a plant. So uh, just hit that button, man. It, it, it's, it's free to subscribe. Just click the button for your boy. Click the button. That's all you got to do, guys. And, you know, I'm trying to grow. I'm trying to build. I'm trying to make the best content. I'm working hard at I'm trying. But you got to help me out too, guys. So if you want to know how I was able to get the money to buy a Vendo 21 drink machine, the best on the market, in my opinion, the easiest to, to deal with, uh, based on the research I did, watch the whole video, help your boy out, and I'm out of here. Yeah. I obtain or will obtain the Vendo 21 machine, uh, blah, blah, blah. <laughs> So guys, you wondering how did I pick up the Vendo 21 vending machine? Uh, I'm about to show you how. Uh, I'm about to show you how I did it. And, um, you know, you just got to make it happen, guys. You got to just do it, man. You know what I mean? Just do that shit, man. Do that shit. What's going on YouTube? It's Marathon Vending, aka Michael's Rich Life. I'm back again with another video, guys. And I wanted to salute my 25 subscribers. I love you guys a lot. And for everybody who's not watching Marathon Vending, or you're new to Marathon Vending, or you watching my videos but not subscribe. It's free to subscribe. Hit that button, guys, and help your boy out. Reach and grow the channel, guys. That's what I'm trying to do. I'm trying to make the best content. Uh, I know that my other videos were shaky and probably horrible, but I'm trying to get better, guys. So I uh, hope your boy out. And you're probably wondering, like, why I'm on this site, like NBA. Top shot. I'm sure you heard about it, but if you have not, this is the hottest and fastest way to invest in sport cards. Uh, basketball is my sport. That's what I know. I'm good at picking um, undervalued hoopers, and I made some money by doing so. So, guys, this is how I bought you know, or will buy my Vendo 21 drink machine is from investing in NBA Top Shot. I know some people who got 60 bands in their account, 120,000 in, in their account, all by flipping a digital 
moment. Like who would ever think that that would be possible? But it's possible. And it's happening. And I'm not trying to be disrespectful, but paid and you just have to be in the know. And um, guys, uh, I think NBA Top Shop is one of the fastest way to flip, man. Um, you know, if you are in the flipping um, business, whether it's phones, it's basketball, cards, it's faster than making money in stocks, in my opinion. It's just fast, man. It's, it's like overnight. So um, this is how I made it, man. Uh, so now I'm able to buy a vending machine, a Bendo 21. And um, let me see if I can find my original investment. Yes, I found them right here. All right, guys. So this is my original investment. Um, you know, I'm looking at his, uh, you know, I'm watching him. You know, I'm seeing his games. I'm seeing you know, what LaMelo Ball and everybody else. And I was like, you know what? Uh, he is undervalued, in my opinion. Um, you know, he came in the NBA hooping college. He was a baller. Uh, you know, he got injured, but then, uh, you know, you know, he struggled for like, you know, uh, some years and, and, and you know, uh, he's healthy now and he's scoring like 20 points a game, man. And um, he can shoot. Uh, he can make his own shot. He got he got some handles and he could flat out play, you know, and he's healthy. I'm like, this is. You know what I'm saying? He's back. And I really uh, believed in him. And he paid off for me. Um, I bought him for $10, man. I bought him for $10. And I sold him for $86, man. And I, I'm not saying that Hay, uh, Hay is, is the best guy in the NBA, but he can score and he can play. And at the time, he was undervalued. So I, I picked him up. For, for for some some chump change and the uh, market decided that he was worth more than ten dollars and at the time when I owned him he was um at 86 bucks man you know so I flipped him I, I didn't have no type of emotion I'm here to make money I'm not here to be stuck on a player like I really you love, you know, love him. I'm about making, I'm about making money. So as soon as I saw an opportunity to 10 X my money, I sold him. And as you see, whoever picked him up, he's down a little bit, you know, but you know what I'm saying? If he hoop, you know, well again, or you, you know, you know, if he scores 20 points in five, basketball games or what it, whatever it is he's gonna go back up but you know that's like uh with everything markets are up and down so uh i'm just making an example of him because i can't um log in because the website is is under maintenance for some reason um but uh but guys i did this over and over and over like i bought a a Middleton, Chris, a uh, Middleton, I bought him for like uh, like $5. I sold him for $68. I bought a, a Nudrovic for, I bought him for $4, man. I bought this dude for $4 and sold him for $50. You know what I'm saying? It's like, you know, I bought a Jimmy Butler that I got for free. I got him for free and I sold him for two hundred and twenty five dollars. Uh, my my brother, he a geek, uh, he and I sold him for over six hundred and fifty dollars and I didn't pay for him. I got him for free. 
And I, I bought a Victor Opa Depot for, for $399, a rookie um, moment. I picked him up for $399. I sold him for $460. So this is how I was able to invest a small amount of money and hit a huge bankroll. And now I'm able to buy the vending machine. So, um, hey, guys, you know, if you got some money laying around, uh, you big on sports, you might have to take a plunge and invest in your sports, man. The, the return on inv investment is huge. It's also risky, but it is, you know, it's freaking huge, man. Uh, you, you don't have to be waiting ye years to to get a return on investment, you know, you know, it's fast. And depending on who you pick, depending on who you buy, it depends on you how long you want to hold. Um, so guys, I'm just super excited, man. I'm just super excited that I was able to invest a smaller amount of money. Now I have the option to take the money that I earned and buy a more higher end um, moment. But I had a strategy, I had a vision. I said, hey, I'm gonna buy these undervalued dudes. I'm gonna flip them and buy the vending machine I wanted. So um, I have to stick with that vision. Now, like if I see an opportunity you know, I made, I, I probably, you know, it just depends. Um, it just depends on, on what is uh, available and, and if I'm able to 10x again. Um, it just depends on the market and what it's doing. And, uh, you know, I may do that. But... The goal was to make that money, buy the vending machine, and get out. So, guys, as you can see, this is a big time moment. This is LeBron James and the Lakers uniform at the Lakers Arena doing the same dunk as Kobe did. Uh, he's showing his respect. He's doing the tribute um excuse me that was hard to get out <laughs> but as you can see guys he's doing the same dunk as kobe um rest in peace um this moment is a big freaking deal man like, like as you see the asking price is sixty five thousand. the um lower the mint the more valuable this thing is as you can see, we got some for 135,000, 100,000, 16 mint. We got one for for 90,000 guys. So as you can see, the lower the mintage, the 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 the, the more unvaluable. This one is at 150,000, which I am confused about this one though. Okay, but yeah, guys, I'm not trying to make this video long, guys. If you know about basketball and you know about the rookies, you know. Oh, yeah, guys, and what's so sweet about NBA Top Shop that if you buy a rookie and when they come with the rookie um, badges, the rookies, the rookies that you have is going to be is going to be. He, you know, hella like uh, like valuable. Um, I sold a Victor Opa Depot. He he was a rookie, but um, he's undervalued in my opinion. And uh, eventually, I, I might buy him again. But uh, you know, guys, once once that rookie badge hit, it's gonna be it's, it's gonna be insane. So. Uh, but yeah, guys, this is the video, 
This is how I obtained a Vendo 21 or will be like once I buy it and I make the video about it, you guys will know. So uh, I'm out of here, guys. Peace.